What's up guys? So, I'm in a field, but I had someone reach out to me on Instagram who will remain nameless. They demanded that I, you can go see it on my Instagram. This person demanded I do a trick tip on a switchio flip. So, today, I'm gonna do just that. We're gonna learn how to do switchio flips. So before you just jump in and learn switch heel flips, you're gonna wanna learn how to switch ollie. So for your foot placement on a switch heel flip, it's kinda different, at least for me. I kinda put my back foot at a slight angle on the tail, more on my heel side, but with my toe. And then I put my front foot, like the balls of my toes to my toes on the edge of my board. And then I pop and do my flick. For my foot placement, my front foot, I always put like just a little behind the front bolts, but I put my toes to the ball of my the balls of my feet to the edge. Normally, I like it towards my toes. And then for my back foot, this is where I said I put it on the heel side, but with my toes on it is like this. So this is my stance for a switch heel flip, going this way. So this is my stance for a switch heel flip. So when you pop on the switch heel flip, you pop straight down and the board's already leaning to one side. You can see my wheel kind of comes up off the ground. And with your front foot, that's when you'd be rolling up and flicking off to the side. And because it's flipping this way, you get the pull and kind of flicks and that's what makes it flick out and level itself. And with the flick, you don't want to flick straight out because if you flick out, the board's going to go out and then it won't be under you. And if the board's not under you, you don't land the trick. If I were to emulate that, it would like if you had your foot on the board and when you pop, it's if you flick straight out, the board's going to shoot out and it won't stay under you and you won't land it. But if you go up and out and you flick off the little curve right here, that's when you'll get it. You might just like roll over and land on the ground and you'll land on the board. But at least you'll get the rotation for the switch heel and you'll get used to seeing it rotate. And you'll be used to flicking it enough that you'll end up landing and learning the trick and getting it super clean and you'll look like Nick Tucker or someone. That last way I was just falling and not putting my back foot on, that's actually a really good way to learn how to get the flick of the trick down. Okay, I'm retarded. Anyway, if you like do the flick but don't commit your back foot, you can learn to get the flick of the switch heel flip down and then eventually committing your back foot and then you'll have switch heels down no problem. But just remember to pop, flick up and out, not straight out, up and out, wait for the grip tape to come around, catch it, land it, right away. You didn't switch heel flips. There's a dragonfly and it came towards me. Oh, there he goes, see? If this video helped you learn switch heel flips in any way, um, do one, put it on Instagram and tag me in it. To my friend that called me out, you have to land it now. So, land it now.
And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, all that. Share my video if you liked it. And let me... So like I was saying, like, comment, subscribe, share if you liked the video. Let me know if you learned switchio flips. Let me know if this video even helped you. For each like, we'll donate five cents to teach this dragonfly how to fly. And thanks for watching.